It is interesting to understand and see continuous interactions between land on one hand, and then the complex land crisis, uh, land issues, and climate change impacts, especially coming from extreme events. And because in the cases where we're working, there is a, a demonstration of um, you know, multiple interests on land, uh, the multiple scales that is household and city scale and national level, the responses also differ. And that is very much informed by the value system, uh, which informs policies like voluntary, involuntary resettlement and or relocation. What is interesting is that a lot of communities that are living in informal areas continuously are exposed to these extreme climate impacts and they temporarily and they voluntarily relocate, but still come back because of course the value other interests more like education and access to employment and even access to health services. Whereas for public institutions, once there is a, um, a risk assessment and vulnerability assessment, the policy is usually a response to either resettle or relocate. And the interplay of that as a response to climate is very much um, mediated by the complex land tenure system in, in, in the places like in Uganda where I've been working. So these issues are quite interesting and important to inform future policies. And it would be great if you join the Land Up Conference uh, this June to hear more. And then we can also have much deeper discussions about land crisis and climate challenges. Looking forward to seeing you.